Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, hope you guys had a very awesome um, 2019 World Championship. Uh, but before we go into our reaction video and so on and so forth, right, I do want to apologize first and foremost because um, if you notice, my voice is different right now uh, because I'm actually not feeling well. I'm having a bit of a sore throat and a flu, but uh, it's okay. Um, I'm recovering right now. So um, what I really want to like really react to is the opening ceremony presented by MasterCard uh, for the 2019 World Championship Finals. Um, I mean, I, I did watch it during um, a viewing party. Uh, though I would say this first, um, I did really put a very high expectation for the opening ceremony, you know, something that maybe could like top off KDA from last year. Um, but I mean, we will talk about it more later after we actually watch this video first. So let's check it out. Looks way better watching over here. <laughs> I'm getting goosebumps again. Oh my god. I like how this time around they actually use holograms for this. That is so cool. to that is very very cool oh, wait <laughs> oh my god oh my god I like her attitude. Her attitude is so awesome. Oh. It's so cool. That is just so cool. I like how they actually transition to like echoes. Um, one of the scale, I forgot which one is it. <laughs> True damage. By the way, stay tuned, I'll be reacting to the MV as well. It's so nice how they actually like transition it. And that, that Kiana ring though. Sana. The LV How they keep the trademark off that one? Oh, 
I just noticed behind there is like a stage. <laughs> You're doing this, so everyone was like, Whoa! It's so cool. You know, um, my boyfriend actually mentioned the art that they were using, like, <laughs> is like um, Spider Man from the multiverse. It's so cool. I like the hologram from behind there though. I mean, it's nice to have a hologram though. It's very cool. But like I mentioned, I did expect it more. <laughs> Sorry for that. During World's Viewing Party, right, people were singing to this song when this was performed. It's so cool. I like this. It's so cool! Oh, the dancers looks cool. Oh yeah! Kudos to Riot for this part, I really love it because as far as I know, it's not easy to synchronize hologram and real life performance. It takes a lot of practice. But that is so cool! That is just super cool. I'm not so sure about this one part. Yeah, the 90 degrees. I didn't notice that verse. love this part as well I mean you know, aside from LV and stuff but oh my god yeah this part where they actually show all the previous world's winners I'm just like it overwhelms me to see all of this oh my god look at that <laughs> dude how crazy is that Oh, they're there! God! Oh my 
god, that looks just so cool. Oh, that holo, holo logos. That is just nice. That's nice. Ah. Bonjour, Paris. Bonjour. All right. So basically, I'm gonna cut it until there, because that's where um you know the opening opening ceremony ended, and you know after that it's just literally just you know them introducing the players and stuff. So, um, I would say uh, this year's opening, I would say, is quite subtle compared to last year because, I mean, last year when they like they when they pulled out KDA, right? That was like the epic, epic thing ever that actually came out. So everyone was like just super crazy about it. So when you know when. They announced that there's gonna be true damage, right? I was really hoping that it's gonna be like something that is way cooler and way better. But like I mentioned, um, I mean the tone of the music is um, I would say for sorry for true damage. Okay, first for true damage is very like I would say it it doesn't really have like that big hype up there. But it has its own like feel to it, so I mean, I wish they had actually do something a bit more, um, you know, because I mean they did they did all this hologram stuff. I mean, it would be better, it will, it will be cool if we can have like more, you know, like a more cooler visual of the true damage. I mean, I understand maybe they wanted to feature the singers as well, but it would be really great if they can actually do. You know, put into consideration of the characters itself over there, you know, like really show it off, like really pop up the um the true damage skins. So but well that's my take on, you know, the the true damage performers. I mean, um uh, for the first performance Awaken, uh even though it was short and simple, but it actually give you the um the hype about it you know you 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 they, they help like set the mood to get hyped but then everything just like went a bit down and then just like went flat a bit somewhat ish like that <laughs> but i mean kudos they actually tried to use hologram this time around uh, because previously as you all know riot used um ar uh for you know, like uh, the KDA performance, the dragons and things like that. So, I mean, kudos for them for trying out the hologram. But maybe um, next year, if they really want to use hollows again, uh, it will actually be, um, I don't know, maybe improve in terms of the quality and, you know, make it a bit more sharp, in my opinion. I don't know. I mean, Hasuni Miku performance was crazy. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I'm not really much of a tech geek kind of uh, person, so I can't really say much on that. But... Uh, like I said, it's kudos that they actually tried, you know, the hollow, uh, the holographic concept of this, which is cool. Um, uh, well, opening ceremony has been awesome, I would say. Um, I would rate it about uh, 8. Because, I, like I said, I was actually hoping a bit more, like maybe something to top off KDA a bit, but <laughs> I guess my expectation was too high. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Riot always tends to like pull out miracles and things like that, but hey, I guess there might be, you know, some change in concept and things like that. So mm, it's okay. I'm cool with it. Performance was awesome. Yeah. So I guess that's all for the opening ceremony that, um, I can talk about, I guess. Um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. There's, it kind of felt something was missing a bit, but uh, it was still okay. Not that bad. It was okay. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> well, I'll see you guys in the upcoming uh reaction video. Hope to see you guys again next time.